Yo two. It's your boy Kobe TV, and I'm back with another react, man. I said I'm back with another react. If there's anything you want to know about your boy Kobe, just look down below in the description. I got all my links to all my platforms, which would be TikTok, Twitch, Instagram, Snapchat. I got all those links down below. Just make sure y'all check that description out, gang. Hey, but for those of y'all who don't know, Prashawn Rock stated that she, well, she tweeted that she going to be deactivating all her pages, all her social media pages, and she going to be changing her address and phone number. Hey, Krishan Rock got a lot going on. She say she say she got to get rid of her enemies, but it's also she, you, as y'all didn't know, I didn't post these this weekend, but I stayed tuned on it. She basically got a lot going on from that Tamar Braxton um little, little shindig. Where so called she um allegedly punched somebody in the face and sent them to the hospital, and she allegedly got a new boo that everybody say look like Blueface, and Blueface mad about it. So Krishan Rock got a lot going on, and I can understand she's trying to run from it. So she's trying to leave all the social media along, and she's trying to change her address and number so she could just get away. And I feel like that's what she need to do. She been needed to do that. But we're going to find out in today's episode, man. But before we get into the video, make sure y'all smash that like. Until all the newbies on the channel, bro, make sure y'all hitting that subscribe button, bro. Turn it on post notifications. We are on the road to 10K. I can't stress this enough. I need all y'all hitting that like and hitting that subscribe as a group, man. But we finna get into today's video and see what Krishan got going on in her life, bro. You're trying to run away from it. Don't run away from it now, Krishan. You been had the chance to do that. You put this all on yourself. It looked like Krishan had to get some stuff out of her chest. She said, I got to work on not giving my energy and clout to my enemies. I'm deactivating all my pages. Love you. See you later. God bless. I mean, ain't nothing wrong with that. <clears throat> Sometimes you need a break away from all the social media bullshit. Especially after the last couple of days she been having, it went from her partying with Tamar Braxton and then she got accused of putting the dude in the hospital, busted uh -huh. his tooth, everybody screaming loud. Hey, but that sound like rock. That sound like something she'll do. They said she did it because supposedly she wanted to perform and they didn't know she rep. And she got offended. That sound like rock, bro. I ain't saying she did it, but that just sound like rock. That sound like something she'll do. Lock her up. She need to go to prison. She's crazy. Oh, my gosh. And now in the day, ain't nobody talking about it. See, that's what I'm talking about. People run with a narrative and just act like it's facts. And anybody with a smartphone and internet connection could get online and tweet or post what whatever they want to post I about see the videos. anybody, any celebrity. And it's so easy to say, well, if you're a celebrity, you're rich, you're successful, why are you worrying about what people say? But they are still real people at the end of the day. It don't matter how much money and fame you got, you still got real feelings. And everybody don't react the same way on social media. And I can look at Christian and tell she's a very emotional girl. She's still growing. There's a lot of learning she got to do. I can already tell she's only 23. When I was 23, I was doing a whole bunch of dumb shit. I'm still learning and growing every day. So I can only oh, imagine thanks. what's going through her mind. She get on social media. They saying Krishan this, Krishan that. Yes, it is a lot of love out there, but you really don't see the love when you see all the hate. You mostly pay attention to the hate. That's what Car What? All you gonna see is hate when that's how you got known, bro. That's how we that's how we know about Krishan. Like, I don't know, bro. How the B was talking about how she need to stay off social media because so many people be saying death she threats. She got known from social wishing media. Wishing the harm on her and her baby. Like behind the screen, you could say anything. Back in the day, you couldn't get close to no celebrity and say nothing. If you seen a celebrity in public and ran your mouth, they security guards would stomp your ass in the ground. But these days, you can get on Twitter and run your mouth, and it would get to you sometimes. That's why rappers like Kendrick, J. Cole, and Drake, you don't see them on social media until it's time to promote something. Because they already know how crazy people is. I hope Krishan... Yo, but Krishan Rock got an image to uphold. We met her through social media, so she got to keep going through social media. She's a reality. We know her through reality, bro. So I feel like that's, the, that's what she got to keep doing. And I feel like... Yeah, social media is toxic. Yeah, it ruins a lot of things, but 
If that's how if that's how you got big, you got to keep going. Don't try to run from it now. You put this image out there like that, Christian. So you got to uphold this image you put out there, and that's that's just how I look at it. Trying to find some time to heal and focus on her and the baby. Like yeah, you need to stop man, sleeping but... with Blueface, but she, she love that D. She crazy man. What y'all think about this, your boy B? Like yeah, you're a human and all, but like sometimes you just got to keep going with what you what you started. You 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 showed everybody all your business, what you and Blue had going on and all of that. Now it's getting toxic and you don't like it. I'm confused. Why why you started it then? Like. A lot of this be seeming like it's just cloud chasing, bro. Cause I'm, I don't know. It looked like Christian had something else to say. She said, "Changing my number, number changing, changing my, my address. address." I'm trying to figure out like, is she gonna be moving again or something? I don't know, bro. She said, she went Didn't you just get that house? See, that's what happened when you, when you wanna get this big old twenty million dollar ass house or however much you said it was. I'm just throwing numbers out there. But however, you, that's what happens when you get this big ass house and you invite everybody over, you post it to the world, you show it and all that, and everybody know where you stay. That's what happens when you do that. That's what comes with that. Don't run from it now. Like, I just feel like a lot of stuff that people attacking you for, Krishan, is your fault. And you're trying to run from it. You shouldn't have put all that info out there like that. You shouldn't have let everybody know where you stay. You shouldn't have showed everybody your house. You shouldn't gave all these people the address to your house. And if you run it from Blueface, he it's no point of you doing that because he going to be at your new house. He going to have your new number. Like, some stuff I just be lost for words on, bro. I don't be understanding. But we'll change her number, change her address. Earlier, she said that she going to deactivate all of her social media accounts. She tired of giving it an enemy's clout. She definitely We're talking enemy, about Blueface. Blueface. I don't believe it. She do this every time both of them start beefing. Y'all give each other get into it. They go back and forth online, and then they go quiet for a couple of days, sleeping around. Then they go separate again. Blueface, he go back to promoting Jaden because for them two three days that they went silent. Blueface, he ain't tweeting nothing about Jaden, nothing about Jaden. He was quiet as a church mouse. You know why he didn't tweet nothing about Jaden? Because he was with Rock. Him and Rock was together the whole weekend. Then when it was time for Blue to start leaving, she want to go live in the shower. Why you live in the shower? You don't ever go live in the shower. But that's because Blueface probably was in the room getting dressed, packing up all this stuff, ready to go. Like, bro, we not stupid. We own to what y'all got going on. You and Blue together was, was together the whole weekend, and y'all didn't get on social media. Like, but then you be mad when, like, Blue leave and get the tweet, and that's your fault. Because he was under Krishan. Soon as they separated... And Krishan started going out and partying, getting back on IG Live, and Blueface started doing the same thing. And then he went back there recording Jaden every day, talking about Jaden is this, Jaden is that. Then Krishan got on live with a dude in the car, and then Blueface got in his feelings. Once again, like this shit happens every three to five. Hey, that's what I was talking about. Yeah, the dude in the car, they say look like Blueface. But look, bro. If you constantly letting Blueface come over and smash, and feel like y'all something or could be something, and then you backdoor and show yourself with another dude, it's just like, yeah, Blueface gonna be mad. Not saying he got the right to be mad, but I see why he's gonna be mad. Cause now he felt like you his. You his woman. Yeah, he beating it up every other weekend. Y'all chilling, yeah, y'all lovey dovey, kissy kissy laid up. And then now you show on social media, you out in the car. With another rapper who looked like Blueface. Y'all already know how Blueface is. He's controlling, as y'all say he is. So, of course, he gonna be mad if he see Rock with another dude right after he leave. Like... Five business days. I don't understand, bro. I don't know why she keep on giving this nigga her energy, but I would not believe it's that she's done fault. with this nigga until she get rid of them tattoos, like... Until it's she do that shit, she put herself she in this always going to be bro. connected to this nigga. Even then, I don't know. Because the rumor is that she pregnant again. Ain't no telling. She was online talking about he was he busting all up in her and shit. So, nigga, blue face know. beating him but guts. If she says she done, only time will tell. But I definitely don't believe this shit. She says she's going to change the address and the phone number. 
We're going to see how long this lasts, man. What y'all think about this, your boy? Beat me, y'all go scramble. Hey, I really don't believe it either, bro. I don't believe it. Like, yeah, you could deactivate all your social medias. You will be back. You ain't finna get rid of that house. You just got it. You ain't balling like that. You might change your phone, though, but who knows? But I don't believe it, bro. You you basically trying to say you trying to get away from Blueface? That's what you trying to say? You ain't gonna never leave that nigga, bro. The biggest step is, like he said, you still got all these texts, but you want to change everything else. He still going to be with you with all them damn texts you got of him on you. Like, you put yourself in this situation, and now you're trying to run from it. Like, you shouldn't have, you should have got away when you could have, when you got your own house and all that shit. Should have left him alone in. When he posted all the pictures of your son and all that, should have left him alone in. Like, it's a lot of times you could have left him alone, but now you see it's getting toxic and toxic and toxic, and now you're trying to run away from it. Nah, don't run away from it now. Hey, keep going, Blueface. Keep being toxic. Keep being toxic. She gonna realize one day. She gonna wake up. But I'm not here to bash you, Krishan. I, I understand what's going on. It's love. Y'all love each other so hard, but y'all not getting what y'all want out of it at the end of the day. I'm not here to bash you. It's just the fact that you should have been got up and left. But I understand it's love. So at the end of the day, y'all gonna learn. Y'all gonna find out where y'all gonna want to be with each other at the end of the day. But, hey, y'all let me know how y'all feel about this video in the comments, bro. Let me know if Krishan need to get up. If y'all believe that Krishan finally leaving this nigga Blueface alone. Let me know in the comments if y'all believe that. Hey, you y'all know I don't believe it. But, hey, before we get up out of here, man, make sure y'all smash that like. Until the newbies, bro, make sure y'all hit that subscribe button, bro. We on the road to 10K. Hey, I need all y'all tapping that like, hitting that subscribe. It's your boy, Cubby TV, and we are...